Hello and welcome back to more Grand Theft Auto 4. I don't have much left of this game and I just want to say a massive thank you to all of you that have been sticking with me through the good and the bad. Um, if you're relatively new to my channel, I had an issue with my face where I had my wisdom teeth removed and they hit my nerve and I've been in a lot of ongoing pain and I still am even as I'm filming this but I'm trying to get through life you know I'm hoping that this isn't as good as it gets I'm hoping that there will be a change in the future but because of that it meant that talking was a major issue for me and it's meant that doing long style videos like this one here it's it's tricky you know so I want to say thank you so much for still being here for supporting me and with that being said let's do a mission and I'm gonna turn it up because I can't hear it hey hey yeah so uh, anyway a friend of mine in here tells me that a close friend of yours, the girl you've been spending a lot of time with recently, swept the clean off her feet. Okay. Yeah, her old boyfriend wants her back. They always do. Desperately and quickly, and he's looking for her. I think you and her should go out on a glamorous date in Algonquin. Show her a new pad. Then things will be okay between you two. But move your fucking ass, pal. Women don't like a chump, you get me? See all these missions right here freaking me out. Just, I don't know if it's just the whole like, I don't know, the picking up the women and yeah. So I would like your car. Please, out. It's really hard sometimes because I get some comments that are like, oh, well, I was watching Susie, but then someone else started playing the game, so I just decided to start watching her instead, and blah, blah, blah. And it's like, it's really hard to get comments like that. And while I appreciate that there is a million content creators on YouTube, and I'm not the only one, it doesn't make you feel any better when you used to be able to just film all the time. Like, when I was just doing Let's Play content, I was able to... Sorry, I just hit the mic. I was able to do three Let's Play videos a day on my main channel, like, without fail. And if a brand new game came out, I was on that shit, you know? Yeah, just, it was so easy for me to do. And now it's just not the case unfortunately it's just so it's so difficult to do ah so yeah when you get comments where someone's like oh yeah well i kind of gave up and i'm just watching this person now it hurts my fifis okay it, just, it, it hurts the fifis so if you are one of these people who has gone and like watches other people like that's fine not even mad but you don't need to say it you know, don't feel the need to say it because there's nothing I can do when it comes to my face or anything like that. There's nothing I can do to make it any easier. What is down here? I do think for a second that I wanted to take this long to finish this game. I'm desperate to know what happens. I really want to know what happens. So I'm like trying my hardest now. I'm like, play, play, play. Is this that same blonde bitch? You're moving up. Yeah. Or what the bowling street? Not in the cab of this car, I'm not. After last time, she can ride in the trunk. Fair enough. Ah, bitch just bit me. Well, I hope she doesn't have COVID. I think she has something to say. Motherfuckers, when my daddy finds you, he's gonna kill you. He's gonna kill everybody you've Get ever you around. Thanks a lot. So wait, now I get to listen to this bitch the entire- Oh, tires. Oh, great. Cool. Oh, shit. She's in the car, you fools. 
I'm not trying to damage the car. Um, like, if Gracie dies, that's not my fault. I'm not the one driving bad. You see that that was good driving. Wow, that's pretty racist, you know? I'm the one that's getting shit done in your country. Not, not, not. Oh, fuck. Okay, it's fine. Gracie, your friends are freaks. You're doing fine, sweetie! You're doing fine! My car, on the other hand, is, uh, probably not. Like, like, there's, like... You already said that! I wasn't offended the first time you fucking said it! Yeah, you see the, um... We're keeping this bitch. The gunshots. Oh, oh. <laughs> Off the back. Yeah, she's probably already dead. Have I lost them? I'm assuming based on what Nico just said, I lost them. Why is the turning so bad in this game? Like, someone please. Someone please enlighten me. Is it here? No. It's here. Like, I can't turn for shit in this game. Nico, my man. Katie's taking over on my duty, so I'll be watching this Guido bitch for you. Where is she? Thank in God. The trunk. She don't play too nice up front. Gracie, Gracie, act nice now. You motherfuckers, I'll rip your cocks off! Help! Help me! Let me out of here! She's a wild one. I'll, I'll try to calm her down. See you later, Nico. Oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm fucking... Why did they take the thing out of her mouth? Like, she's annoying. You know? Just let the bitch die. Or shall I say, let the bitch be quiet is probably the, the thing I actually meant to say. <laughs> let the bitch die. Okay, so we've got another one down there. And I don't know why that one is dark. It's okay, Ashley, you can have your car back. No respect for old ladies. To Algonquin Duke's Expressway, please. Quick, she's gonna like take me out of the taxi or some shit. That's great. Thank you. So, how did I take damage in that one? It's all about problems and solutions. Ah, oh, Nico! Of course, you guys already know each other. Nico, good to see you. Interesting friendships you both keep. Yeah, very interesting. The mayor will be here in a minute, and I have two senators dropping by later. Everyone wants to pay homage to a dying legend. Everyone wants the glamour of a bygone age. Everyone. Now that you hear what I said. Yeah, I heard what you said. Nico, our friend here, is telling me that the Ancelotti's are in league with the Russians. Ancelotti's? I know these guys 73 years. In 1972, I should have killed his uncle, but I spared him. And this is how he repays me? Unbelievable! I'm and now he's fucking drugs believable! I'm the goddamn terrible! <laughs> so, what we're saying is this is a matter of security, <laughs> national. Normally, I don't care about cocaine, keeps controllable people in power. But this is no good. All right, what's my role in this? The distribution network is a fleet of vans parked at a grocery warehouse in Alderney City. The product is packed into the frames of the vans, ready to be moved all over the country. Destroy everything, whatever it takes. And for me? For you. I've got a real gift for you. Get this done, then we'll talk. <laughs> I hate that shit. That's like... Taking a job and someone's like, yeah, I'll pay you good, like, but do this for me first, then we'll talk about it. No one would do that. You know, no one would do that. Okay. 
It's very quiet. I want your car! I actually want my car back. And unfortunately, in typical Susie style, I've lost it. Um, I think I was supposed to save it. Oh, fucking hell, dude. It's a very dirty car. I think I was supposed to save it before I actually quit the game. And I quit the game. Look at the state of this car. Of course this is the one I steal. I quit the game, came back in, and then I was like, oh, wait a minute. I didn't put it into a garage or anything like that, so I think it's just... It's gone, and I haven't... Watch where are you going? Why don't you watch where you're going, bitch? Check your meters. So yeah, it's, um... It's a sad day in GTA because my car is gone. But that's okay. Skirt! That kind of worked out. There's a lot of traffic here today. So how have you guys been? What has been going on? Gonna bore you guys to tears. I have my wedding dress. I have put my deposit down. My bad. I have picked my wedding dress. I have tried it on. And did you know, because I didn't, that when you go in to try on a wedding dress, they ask you to take your bra off. Okay, settle down settle. They ask you to take your bra off and then they just come in with you. So I was like stripped down, okay, to my thong, okay, and had to show my bits to a complete stranger that I had just met so that she could help me try on all these dresses. And no one warned me. No one told me that this is how it was going to be. Like obviously it was a, a lady. And like that was fine. But it was so awkward. Oh, I'm being phoned. In the game. What? Okay, I'm not. It was so awkward that I um I just kinda stood there and she's like, right, get into this dress, blah blah blah. And I was like, this is just okay. So nobody warned me that that was gonna be a thing. But ladies, if you're watching, that's what happens. Because obviously, you don't really wear a bra on your wedding day. Which funny, I didn't know that either. But anyways, the more you know. Am I right? I have been working with Shit. a tire iron sure. recently. Effective! This better not be a timed mission. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Do I have an RPG? Do they have an RPG? He's got a sniper. Okay. That's cool. So, I just gonna kill them all, right? I gotta destroy the vans. Well, I mean, I could just drive in like this. Oh. Maybe not. This, um, not good. I just want to see, I've got no sniper. I've got sniper, but I don't have... I don't have an RPG, so yeah, that is what it is. You're dead, friend! Come on, bring it out. Hmm. Wait. I feel like this might actually be... Oh, no, I like this car. I want to go in there and... Let's kind of see what I'm dealing with. 
One, two. Oh, I, I ran him down. Doink. Wait, did that just take some of my... Okay. So it's a shame because I really like this car, but never mind. Hello. Well, that was silly now, wasn't it? Don't know where that went. Oh! How did that go down? Was that good? Was that bad? Ah, didn't even hit this guy. You're going to die, friend! Oh god, that guy just flew. Right, one, two, three, four, five. Ah, motherfuckers! So I got nine grenades. <laughs> See, I told you guys I'm getting quite good at the whole grenade thing now. Why can't I? Do I have to be off? Oh, I have to be off the wall. Is he dead? Hellman, that was rough. You win. Really? Come on. How we doing? Be afraid, friend. Push me. Push me. I don't want to be too crazy. In case one guy's got a shotgun. Look at Nico. Don't fuck with me. Okay. Um sure. Why do I feel like this is going to be a police issue? So, let's just Oops. Destroy the vans. All right. Just wanted to double check that. Where are you, buddy? Ah, oh, I see, I see. How do I get to you? Not so confident now, asshole. Really? I think you just died, sir. There is definitely someone still alive. 
Okay, this might take a bit longer than I want, so... Happy days. He's after the vans. Shit, he's trying to destroy the stuff. Where are you, sir? We don't want to lose the cocaine. killed the guy in it. Cool. So let's get a grenade and let's just launch it. Yeah, boy. Okay, that was fun. That actually wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Because I thought that mission was going to be bad. I have put your competitors out of business. Given a dying man a few minutes of happiness, Nico. I'm pleased to be helping you out with this thing you need. We'll speak again when Darko Brevich is in the country. Nice. So he must be the main mission guy, then. He's the one that we gotta get through all his missions. Thank you. Probably could have done with getting a little bit more HP, but it's fine. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. I agree, honey, but they are expensive. Don't forget that. But I like looking at it every day. Hey. Yeah. What's wrong? There's good news and there's bad news. Good news is... Everything's coming together. Bad news? Ain't gonna make a blind bit of difference to me. Uh, what do you mean? Do you want me to spell it out? He's not getting out. No, I guess not. Thanks. Pack, you'll give you a call and explain. The ex-boyfriend of your girl is gonna agree to the divorce terms. Unfortunately, turns out he wasn't our only problem. Some other crap has turned up. I don't think I'll be getting out anytime soon. Been a great laugh. Look after yourself. Yeah. Well, I've seen that one coming, if I'm being honest. I just want Nico to stop doing all this dodgy, dirty stuff. That's all I want. Nico, me and Gracie is waiting for you just off of Frankfurt Avenue in Northwood. Looks like our joyful time with her is coming to an end. That's a fucking tragedy. 
We should throw her a goodbye party. That's the plan. Hopefully someone might bring a big present for us to this shindig as well. Maybe a big bag of diamonds will help us get over the pain of losing her. We're waiting for you, man. Go to Packy's car in Northwood. I thought when I finished the last episode, I'm stealing a car right outside of a fucking prison. <laughs> Why am I so stupid? I completely forgot where I was for a second there. Like, yeah, hold on, let me just steal this vehicle right outside the prison. Like, look at all this police everywhere. Whoopsies. Never mind. Don't worry, you might have my friend in there, but you ain't catching me, it's for sure. Can I not go... Okay, I'm gonna lose him anyway. Come on, lose him. Yeah, there's one thing I will not miss from this game, and that is the driving. I have never gotten used to the driving in this game. Not at all. And I know that most of it is my fault because I'm looking down at the map and smashing into other cars, but it's the turning? I can't handle the turning at all. So, yeah, I will not be missing that. Yeah, I thought I, right before the end of the last episode, did I do that mission? I'm gonna have to check. Maybe I did. Because I was expecting to get a phone call at the start of this episode here today and then make a decision and kill someone, but I... Maybe I already did it? Have I gone slightly crazy? Now, I probably should have got some food before starting this. Maybe I'm also in the worst car possible, but that's okay. That's okay. Now, I'm well aware that you can... I didn't mean to do that. Fuck, I pressed the wrong button. That you can speed turn, handbrake turn is the one I was looking for. But I feel like even that wasn't very good. This guy's car is miles away from where I was. Yards. Turn right. Okay, we lost them. Definitely a boss at losing the one star police. Yards. Turn left. Yeah, I think I've just picked the worst car possible, but it's fine, we're here now. Oh, there it is. That sat nav is so happy. Watch the car blow up. Hey, man. All right, Nico. The exchange is over on Charge Island at the water treatment plant. This better be a nice car. Oh, yeah, this car turns much better. Becky, my man. How are you and Gracie getting on? Like a house on fire, ain't that right, Gracie? <laughs> See, she was just telling me how much she loved me. What do you think of Nico, Gracie? I fucking hate the fuck of you! Gracie, watch your mouth. Nico's a good friend of mine, don't say that about him. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! Gracie, you're sweet. I know, I'm too good for him, but sometimes a guy has got to hang out with lowlifes like Nico here. He's got his uses. I got you some fucking uses! That's right, he is definitely a bad influence on me. What? I didn't... I am not a bad influence. Can you guys stop turning left? For once, it's not left. This car is gonna get mangled before I go anywhere. Wait, what the fuck's going on here? Am I going straight? I was like so confused for a second there. Going straight, and then I have to get onto the other side. Oh, no, 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 no. We're turning down here. Can't follow 
set. No way, we're not turning that. Hello? I just threw that from afar. Take my five dollar dollar. Kinda wish I was doing this during the day. Look at it turn though! This car actually turns. Nice. So I have been playing this shiz out of um, an RPG. You guys know I, I love RPG games. I'm not gonna say what it is because the internet is cruel and will be like, oh, that's the one where so-and-so dies at the end. Probably. I'm not having it. This one's for me. I got given the, there's like the second one of it and I was like, I haven't even played the first one yet. <laughs> so finally, of an evening, sitting down to play, whoops, the first one. I love it so much. Like it is so good, you guys. So good. Go around the back to the exchange point. I put 16 hours in like three days, two days into that game and I was like, yeah, this game's good. This game is good. How's this gonna go? Gracie, you all right? The bastard didn't hurt you, did they? She can't speak. We got a gag in her mouth. Give her back, you animals. She suffered enough. Hand over the stuff. Hand over Gracie. Oh, this shit. I'm here for you, sweetie. Hand over the fucking stuff. All right, calm down, both of you. Or you. We put the ice in the middle. We walk back. Then, you send over the girl. We leave, and you pick up the stuff. Entiende? Sure. Show us the goods. Why are you being so suspicious, huh? Just go, there it is! He's gonna ask me to go pick it up, isn't he? Come Just to back double to check. Me, honey. Let her go. She's gonna pick it up on the way. No, she can't do that. She's handcuffed. Or gagged. Whatever. I knew it! Nothing ever goes right! Who the fuck are you? Nikabalik. How is it? That whenever something is stolen from me, you are not far away. I have never stolen anything from you, Mr. Bulgarin. This man, the big pedic, and his Dominican beach, they stole my diamonds. And you have been trying to rob the thieves, to rob me. Can't you? Oh, for fuck. I don't care what you did to that man, but we ain't leaving here without them diamonds. All right, that's fine. All right, I think I know who's got the ice. Follow me. I should have got a burger. I'm behind cover. You're the one fucking moving. You 
glad you messed with me! Let's go. I'm running out of ammo. This guy's gonna die, right? And I'm gonna have to redo this entire fucking mission. Just wait. There's some more of them up there. Oh my god, get out of my fucking way! Oh man. Well, the ice has got to be this way. Let's split up. I'll take the high road and you take the low road. And I'll be in Scotland before you. Oh fuck. This is stressful. Yeah, now what? Okay, okay. I'm quiet because I'm like, this is a lot. Give us that fucking ice! You're trapped! We'll let you go if you give them up! <laughs> I'm screwed either way. If I don't give you the diamonds, you kill me here and you take them. I do give you the diamonds, Mr. Bogarin kills me later. I don't nobody have them. Screw all of you. Oh, fuck's sake. You selfish piece of cock sucking shit. Spend another minute in this crap hole. Let's get out of here. I'm like, how do I get on the ladder again? Okay. Jesus <sighs> Christ, why did I was like, I am not jumping down and killing isolated. myself right now. It was just plain selfish. There's always one who ruins it for everybody else in the class. You're telling me. We would have let him live. 
He could have walked away from there. Instead, he's fucked, and the diamonds are who knows where. A lot of people are going to be upset about that. My brother Gerald is going to be one of them people. There ain't much that can cheer him up now that he thinks he's doing serious time, but this is really going to piss him off. It's going to be a nice thing to mull over. You know, while he's staring at them metal bars for the next decade or so. A guy like Jerry can still do stuff in the joint. He organized this kidnapping shit, didn't he? Can't be the only card he's got to play. Fuck, he wasn't too chipper the last time I spoke to him, and he's gonna be a long way from chipper when I tell him what went down. If I can get what went on straight in my head in the first place, that is. Okay, so we exchange Gracie for some diamonds that Ray used to have. Then some Russian turns up saying they're his, then everything goes to shit. That's about right, isn't it? There's nothing right about this situation. But that would be an accurate description of what went down. The Russian. Pretty much. Called Ray Bulgari. I worked for him on the Adriatic. He thought I stole from him and he came after me. I had to leave Europe because of him. And they were his diamonds? I don't know about that. They're nobody's now. The only thing that makes me smile about this shit is that Bulgarin does not have the ice. Piece of shit does not even stay at the fight to see the outcome. Just leaves his boys to clear up. We was outnumbered, Nico. I can see how he thought it was covered. This is not the first time he has assumed that I would be killed by some of his employees. Hopefully one day I'll be able to teach him his lesson by putting a bullet through the back of his head. You're not meant to say what you wish for out loud. It won't come true if you do. That rule even works for wishes as cheerful as yours. Listen, this is gonna happen. That guy's a fucking asshole. So that's it, you guys. We have actually found what we're looking for. And I'm ready. I'm ready to kick his ass. Of course he's after diamonds, though. I get out my fucking way. I just want to get to the end of this mission because this one has been quite a long mission and I can imagine Dying on that one would be an absolute nightmare. Like a complete nightmare, you know? But I did like that car, though. Ugh. Oh. Well, Nico, that was a whole lot of effort for no fucking reward. Story of my life. It is the story of a lot of lives, Becky. I'm getting used to hearing it. See you, Nico. I gotta go break the news to Gerald. At least I'm gonna be on the other side of some bulletproof glass to him. But you know what? I'm still fucking scared. Good luck. Yeah. Good luck. You're gonna need it. So, the main guy is in the mix right now. Oh, can't believe it. Hated him as well. It was like as soon as I seen him, I was like, oh, so you're Too the much. guy. Huh. I get it now. I hope that we get That's to kick his ass. You know, every time we come here, she calls Nico a fat shit. Like, it's really sad. Enjoy. Try not to Thank you. Bye. So as of this moment, we're just waiting on him. We're waiting on Packy telling his brother. Oh, there we go. I have your man. He's been flown in. We're going to drop him in the airport cargo area for you. No more jobs? Is that it? Am I out? You're out. You've done good things for us, and we are grateful. That said, I've given you a lot of protection. From here in, you're alone. Goodbye. Oh my god. Okay, he's flown in, and all I need to do is go and get some weapons. Roman, they brought Darko Brevich into the country for me. This is almost over. I'm going to finish it. Nico, you can't do this alone. I'm coming with you. Come collect me from Firefly Island. All right, wait there for me. Oh my god. This can't be it, though, right? Like, okay, I just, I don't know what I choked on, but I just started choking on something, so I had to go and get some water, because that was nasty. Okay, so we have Roman, 
And it's actually, it's not letting me go to the safe house. I was hoping I could so we need to go to save it before I could go to Roman, but apparently that's not an Thank option. Whoa, da da da! Oh. Oh my god. I'm gonna take Fucking... a bat to your ass! Do I have to kill you? Are you? Well, this is the big moment. You've been waiting for for so long. You will not be disappointed. You. Disappointment is not a consideration. I have not been the same man since the day that Darko betrayed us, since I saw those things. We lost a lot of friends that day, Nico. We both did. In some way. Our friends from the village were lucky. I lost myself that day too. Everything that was good and innocent in me died along with them. If I could live those hours again, I think I would have preferred to be buried in the pit along with everyone else. This is all that is left of me. What am I good at, Roman? What is my trade? The deal and death. Because that is all that is open to me. I will tell you what you are good at, Nico. You are a good cousin and a good friend. You still have integrity. No matter what you say, there is humanity in you. You still have the power to be good. It's important that you believe that. Maybe I will start to believe it when Darko is dead. That might give me some perspective. This killing must stop sometime, Nico. Once this is done, then you must begin to forgive. Think about your future instead of the horrible things that have happened to you. To us! To all of us, in the past! After this is done, then we can talk about forgiveness and redemption. Now is not the time for such conversation. No, he's still very much in revenge mode. And then maybe when <laughs> this is all done and dusted, um, we can focus on Roman's wedding, because that would be nice. I, I knew that was going to fucking happen. I was like, I'm gonna end up hitting, and then I'm gonna have to leave, and I'm gonna have to lose the cops. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Police, last thing we need. Yeah, I know, I know. Let's just circle around. Why? I fucking... Let's just see if I can go around here. Okay. I can't drive in this game, okay? I'm well aware of this. <laughs> but if there's one thing I can do, I can kill. So, like, I don't know why, but I, I've got just this feeling that I'm like, is this it? Is this where it all ends? Well, I've got my armor, and I've got... I've got my armor, I've got my ammo, I've got my favorite weapons, and um, this is it, you guys. How did I get so turned around? Like, I was right next to where I needed to be, and then I didn't think I drove that far away, to be honest, and then now, <laughs> I ended up so far. Right, I just gotta be careful not to drive into any of the police. I don't wanna do that again. What'd you do that for? Alright. This is it. This is where it all ends. Oh my god. He kind of looks like me. It's the wrong guy, isn't it? Don't even tell me. You remember me? I don't know you. Yes, you do. I'm the one who survived. Zato što smo bili prijatelji. Svi smo odrasli za jedno. 
Mita, Dragan, Goran, Mio, Mogodanastarim, Sfio, huh? We were friends, but I am never friends. Wrong thing to say. Goran and his guys killed. My fucking neighbors! Because of what? Because of shit! Lies! Fucking lies! So that makes it okay? To stab your friends in the back? Everything you believe is shown to be shit. You make strange choices. Fuck yes. you! Strange choices? How much? <laughs> A thousand. <laughs> you kill my friends for one thousand dollars. How much did you charge to kill someone? You ruined me, you fuck! I needed the money. I had problems. You're a fucking junkie! Kill me, Dan! You fucking hypocrite. Trust me. You're doing me a favor! He's already dead. He knows what he did. Yeah, he's already dead. has been about this point. The whole game has been about this point. Doing all these jobs, killing all these people. Is it all in vain? If you don't kill him? What's the point? Why did you do it all, if you don't kill him? But then, as I literally just said, he's already dead on the inside. Come on, Nico. It's time to go. Where am I? What is this place? Will you take me over to Bruce's house? See you, buddy. I'm turning this shit off. I can't take listening to those annoying ads and DJs right now. I mean... I think it's not often that I can be sure of them. You definitely did the right thing. I'm proud of yourself. Let's have a fucking party. Break out the champagne and let the diseased, traitorous junkie live after hunting him for over a decade. Shit! Someone hand me the keys to the fucking city. There's no need to take that toll, cousin. I'm sorry if my toll offends you, Roman. But this has been a very difficult moment for me. It took every fiber of my being, pulling in the same direction, not to kill Dargo, to not get revenge for all those lives he took away. What made you spare me? I don't know. I wanted it for so long, he would just be dead. Like everyone else from our village. I was the one that survived the first attack. <laughs> Living is not easy. No. I would live to kill the Darko as well. But then when I looked at him, I realized that nothing would change if I killed him. Revenge would not somehow shut the book of what I have seen. Did those who die get closure? Living to God. So you keep living. And you try to have a happy life. You, you try to move on. I try to. Yes. I I know it's like such a a crazy thing to choose because this entire game has been about that moment of raising your gun to him and shooting him. The entire game has been about that. 
so to not do it I know I'm the one that made the choice but I I feel like I've made the right choice I don't know why am I suddenly a good Samaritan no like we have killed so many people to get to this point so I don't know here we are do you want to come in and hang with Brucey no I need to be alone <clears throat> Thank you for being with me, cousin. Do not mention it. Call me, Nico. The wedding is soon. That's fast. So my question is now... Now what? I just... Florian, I thought I should let you know. I found Darko. Guilt has destroyed him. I don't know. Somehow, it was better to walk away. You know what? I'm really proud of you, Nico Bellic. After what we've had to live with these last 12 or 13 years, I know how much it hurt you. And you walked away. I know this must be hard for you, but you won, Nico. You really did. We've got to celebrate. You're free now. Maybe a spa day? Sure, whatever. I'll speak to you soon, Bernie. Hey man, you got my kilo? So yeah, I... Yep. Now I'm like... What do I do? Because... I... Just dropped another ounce. So I let him walk away. Okay. And I do think that... Even though we've done so much, it was the right thing to do. It would have been very interesting to see what would have happened had I not, had I killed him. <laughs> Love Packy. So now I'm just kind of like, well, that's not the end. And I have nothing. I have nothing on my screen. So, like, what do I do? Is he going to come back and kill me now? Oh, fucking Dimitri. You love to disappoint me. Are you disappointed that I have not found and killed you yet, Dmitri Raskolov? Do not worry, your time will soon come. I went to the sewage works on Charge Island. I picked through the bodies, and yours was not amongst them. Very disappointing. I'm sorry. Or maybe the thugs who failed to kill me should be blamed, though. I cannot believe that you would steal from my friend <coughs> Ray Bulgarin twice. First in Europe, and then these diamonds in Liberty City. You are in debt to him, Nico. Why don't you just pay him what you owe, and we can all get along? I have no debt to Bulgarin, Dimitri. And the only thing I owe you is a bullet to the temple. You will be paid in full. Fear not. You have a sharp tongue, Nico. It is only a matter of time before it is cut out of your mouth. Goodbye. Oh, I'm so scared, Dimitri. So scared. How many times have you tried to kill me? And it's failed, right? I was gonna say, don't I have... No, oh, safe house is there. Like, oh, I'm so terrified. Oh, actually, there's a taxi over here. So, I feel, other than the Dimitri side, and then you've got, like, Bernie, and all of that. It doesn't feel like we're done. Like not at all. It still feels like we've got a lot to do. I need this. Um, what are you doing to me? Why is it do I like there's it? so much more to do, even though that main Great. section Thanks. I've, I've done it. So anyways, I'm gonna oh. Shit has gone down. I need to see you. Come to the club in Tudor. All right, Mr. Pegorino. I'll see you there. 
I love that guy. Right, I'm gonna go and save it. I don't know how close I am to the end, but I'm all out of time for this episode. Where's my bed? I want to know... Well, I don't want to know what that decision has done, obviously, because we're not done yet. However, I want to know how many of you chose to do that on the first time you played this game. I thought there was a phone going off. It's a bloody alarm clock. That's so funny. All right, you guys. I'm all out of time for this episode of GTA. Yeah, let me know how many of you decided to be kind at the end there, given that the entire point of the game is killing everyone to get to that moment, you know? I don't know. All right, thank you so much for watching my reaction. My reaction, oh my God. All right, make sure you are subscribed to my channel for more Grand Theft Auto, and I will catch you all in the next episode. Bye, guys.